Oh, get cub bed, they said. It'd be fun, they said. Hello, everybody, and welcome. You stepped out of your time machine into another world. Where animation is older and games are harder. Welcome to Cuphead. How's everybody doing? My name is Jaren. Welcome to Play On. I'm glad you're here. Um, I'm gonna. I'm doing this, everybody. You demanded it. And uh, I guess I guess we're doing it. Uh, who should I be? This cup or this cup? I don't. I don't see the difference. I'm gonna. I'm gonna pick blue cup. New blue cup winked at me. I think this is gonna be good. Okay, I've heard so many horror stories about this game and how hard it is. So great, just great. Um, I don't. I mean, I don't. Is this this game have an actual story? Cuphead. Don't deal with the devil. Here we go. Once upon a time, in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watchful eye of the wise elder Kettle. One day, the two boys wandered far from home and, despite the elder Kettle's very many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog, exclaimed King Dice, the casino's sleazy, sleazy managers. These fellas can't lose. Uh, Nice run, boys, laughed the newcomer. The brothers gasped. It was the casino's owner, the devil himself. Now how about we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. With one more roll and all the loot, or win one more roll and all the loot in my casino is yours, the devil boomed. But if you lose, I'll have your souls. Deal? Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nodded and grabbed the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no, cried Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. See, I picked Mugman. I think I made the right choice. <laughs> Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the door. You lose. The brothers trembled in fear as he loomed over them. Now about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their very lives. Th there must be a way to repay you, Mugman stammered. Yes, please, Mr. Cuphead added. Gosh, this is long. Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil snickered, pulling out a parchment. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me and I might just pardon you two mugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls, otherwise I'll be collecting, I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panted Cuphead. We have to find the Elder Kettle. He'll know what to do. He's gonna kick your ass. That's what he's gonna do. Hi, uh... What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourselves into. I don't know if you want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fate. We must play along for now, collect those contracts, and you'd be na best be ready for some nasty business. Your debtor friends won't be very kind and friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into terrible beasts, actually. Take this potion so they won't try to hang, don't hang you out to dry. It will give you the most remarkable magical abilities. Well, Kettle, if you've had this all this time, now go use my writing desk there, Miss Inkwell there. You need to prepare yourselves for a scrap. This? Tutorial, here we go. Alright, Mr. Kettle. Yeah, I'm gonna exit. Let's go. I didn't know this had an overworld. This is cute. Quick. Oh, okay, who are you? Hey, fellas, look like you're in for it now, eh? Well, I used to be the same way, always getting into trouble, running around. Okay, all right. Three coins. Wow, good thing I talked to him. Well, let's go to the shop, see if he's got... 
Pork Rinds Emporium. Welcome. Welcome. I have four, okay. Roundabout. Extra hit point. Long range below damage. I kind of feel like I should just start with an extra hit point. Alright, let's try it. Goodbye. Goodbye. Interesting voice clips there. You got to equip some purchases. <laughs> yeah, bums. Cool, so now I should have four hearts. What is this? Difficulty selection. Regular or simple? Let's do regular. I'm going to try the regular difficulty and then we'll see if I'm ready. Okay. Ow. Can I parry those items? No. Cool. That was not that wasn't hard. Oh, he's not dead, that's why. Okay. Oh gosh, okay, okay, dodge the dodge the butt. Okay, dodge the dodge the blaps while shooting the blaps. Oh crap. Oh, oh no! It's Carrot Top! Oh! Your jokes aren't funny! Actually, they are. Ah! Okay, okay, alright. This jazz has got me pumped up too. No! Retry. Alright, first death. Oh, that was stupid. That was stupid. I'm gonna die again. Alright, now we dodge the rain. I don't know what the difference between the red ones and the blue ones are, but I do not intend to find out. Run, 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 move, move along, move along. No! Oh no, I died again. <laughs> okay, okay. Problem. Okay, I only lost one, but that's okay. This part's easy. Oh, I say that, and then I get cupped on. Twice. What are the red ones, dude? The red ones not do anything? I guess it doesn't matter now. I'm gonna die. Again? Alright. Oh, that's fine. I wanted to. I need to retry anyway. It's 
ever vigilant in not getting rained on. As the water will go directly into my brain. Cause I've got a mug for a head. A cuphead. Mugman. Mugman sounds like Meg Man Mega Man. Almost there. Oh, come on, he's got so much health. And I have so little. No! <laughs> Damn it, no! Okay. Damn it! Okay. Yes, yes. Oh. Yes, yes. Okay. Skirt. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, 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 okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. You guys, what this? Shout out to whoever totally knew that uh, this game is like ridiculous. I mean, I did. I knew what I was getting myself into. Okay. But the jazz is doing it for me. No! Arg! Oh! Yes! Can't believe I dodged that. Okay, this is all right. I'm up in my game. I'm up in my game! No! No! Stay focused and feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme kind of stuff, you know? Great. Feel the rhythm, feel the rhyme. Feel the rhythm, rhyme. Cuphead time. That band is not stopping either. They're just like, nope. We got 40 more pages of music for this level, so you're you're good. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. Woo! 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 All right. Big woo woo woo. Bloom. Lap. Bloom. Four. Five. Okay. Okay. That was less than graceful. Yes. No. Come on. Come on, just give me this one. Nope. We give you nothing! But you can't... I can't... Basically cannot lose a health in the first two forms. Which I've gotten almost down. The second form's easy. I say that and I'm gonna get blipped, but... Uh, oh! Oh! And another! Alright. I think I've got it. Ah, uh, okay. Got it. Got it. Alright, ultimate focus. Once upon a time, there was a carrot who couldn't care about anything. He said, I'm a carrot. Why should I care? And it was a good life form for a while. He really... Everything worked for a, a long time. He kind of got away with being the carrot who didn't care about anything. But, uh... Eventually, he, uh... Grew tired. And eventually, he would meet... Another carrot. Named Carrie. Carrie Carrot. Uh, and he eventually started to feel something inside of him. Uh, this feeling that he never felt before. A very strange uh, and rather emotional feeling. Uh, or so he thought, you know. The carrot who could never care at all. All of a sudden thought he started to care about this other carrot named Carrie. Carrie the Carrot. Who he, ca who he cared much about. Uh, or so he thought. Little did he know, uh, he would later get broken in half. 
I won! Play on. Play on. Play on.